DaVinci Eye Mural Maker lets you create huge drawings and paintings on any surface. The app works similar to the original DaVinci Eye app, but with one huge difference. The Mural Maker uses two iOS devices. The first device acts as a video camera, live streaming your canvas. The second device, also called the drawing device, goes in your hand and displays the live feed. The app then puts an image you want to draw on top of the feed digitally. Now, if I look at my iPad, I can see the picture that I want to draw on top of my canvas, and I can easily trace it. Unlike a projector, I can also accurately compare colors and shades on my canvas to the original reference image. Before you get started, it's very important to go to your phone's control center and make sure the Wi-Fi button is white and not blue. For iPhones with a home button, you need to swipe up from the bottom of the screen to get to the control center. For everything else, put your finger above where the battery icon is and swipe down. Again, you want to make sure that the Wi-Fi button is white and not blue. So let's get started. Step one, press the plus button in the top right corner of the screen and then select camera device. It's best to make this device an iPhone and not an iPad because iPhones have way better cameras. Step two, place your phone on top of a tripod. Step three, align your canvas using the grid. This prevents any image distortion and then set the focus to turn off the autofocus. You can also set the resolution of the video being sent. Just be careful, the higher the resolution, the finer the detail you will be able to see on the drawing device. But with a higher resolution, you may also see more lag between the camera and the drawing device. Here's another pro tip. Try pressing the record button to record a time-lapse video of yourself drawing. This is super fun and you could post this video to your social media pages afterwards. Step four, start your drawing device. This is the device that you're going to hold in your hand while you draw. This device could be a second iPhone or an iPad. Press the plus button on the top right corner of the screen and then select drawing device. Pick the image that you would like to draw and once the drawing mode opens, the app should automatically detect the streaming device. If at any point the camera becomes disconnected, just turn the connect switch on and off and it should fix this issue. Next, you can press the move button to position your picture on top of the canvas. You can pan, rotate, enlarge, and shrink the image relative to your canvas. Then, make sure to press move again to lock the image in place. You can now zoom in to draw fine details or zoom out to see your picture as a whole. Now you can press opacity to adjust the transparency of your overlay image. You can also press the tools button to hide the toolbar at the top of the screen or you can press the hide button to go into a full screen mode. Pro tip, use the strobe feature to compare your drawing to the original reference image. This is the most powerful tool in the entire app. Another pro tip is try using the different filters and the breakdown mode to add stylizations, see color values better, and to make your image easier to draw. Finally, it's time to start creating. If you have any questions about using the app, feel free to send us an email to info at davinciiapp.com.